fell in love with him for the way that he treated everyone around me, including my whole family, myself. I knew that she had something, the way you give yourself away when you sing. James Horner, My Heart Will Go On, came to see us to propose that song. I didn't want to record it. Thank God I let him decide in the business. After Renee's death, Celine tried to carry on with her music, but it was too painful. What's the hardest part going forward without Renee? I have to take decisions now. Do you think Renee would think that this song is appropriate? Did you ever consider not coming back to the stage? When he was sick, he always said, show must go on. Celine Dion broke down performing her iconic song, All By Myself, just months after her husband's tragic death. Everything started to, like, is this an earthquake? Losing a half of you because we were partners, we were one. There are some who worry about you, who worry that you're a little too thin. Celine's grief was eating her alive. Then she got an unexpected letter from an admirer. See, a letter on my right side, and it says, personal and confidential for Miss Celine Dion from Ryan Reynolds. We had this amazing song. We were all sitting around trying to figure out who's gonna sing it for the movie. The studio piles up a whole bunch of sort of millennial friendly type singers that we just thought, let's go right to the legend. Let's see if we can get her. I sent her a long letter. Little did Celine know, just months before, Ryan had also lost someone he loved.